This week we are visiting Historic Paw Park in Sanford, Florida with our resident dog park experts, Anna and Elsa. Now I just pulled up and initially there only seems to be one entrance, which considering Anna and Elsa are both small dogs, that's a little nerve wracking. So hopefully I'm going to look around a little bit, see if we can find another entrance for the small dog area. So initially, right off the bat, I'm not able to find another entrance. So we're going to go ahead and go through the main one that's right next to the sign. It's actually kind of slow today, probably because I came on a weekday. So hopefully we won't run into any trouble. And I might actually find the small dog, small dog area when we get in. So as you can tell, as soon as we walk in, this is actually a really good sized park for being in the middle of a city. Sanford is kind of a busy city, so the fact that we do have so much land for this park is really impressive. They have a couple of different types of water fountains, which I think is nice. I don't know if anybody can see this, but it's actually a really cool mister. So that way, you know, if it gets too hot and the dogs need to cool off, you can bring them under here. And it's time, so it's not going all day. This, I absolutely love this idea. They even have baggy stations garbage cans, and a shovel to make sure that you can clean up any mess your pet makes. So I find it interesting that we have this here because to me it's clearly a small dog play area, but we're still within the main park. So they might not actually have separations here. the small dog area and it's actually off into the corner and we're gonna go ahead and explore that now we already have made a friend on the other side of the fence named Spongebob so let's go play
So this is a small dog area. Um, right off the bat, I'm not very impressed. It doesn't look like there's nearly as much room, like less than half, I would say. And on top of that, there's nothing really for them to play on. So we're gonna hang out in here for a little bit, play with SpongeBob, our new friend, and just kind of see what happens. Resident dog park experts, did you have fun? Yeah, did you get to run around and make new friends? I'm glad. Well, that was our day in historic Paul Park in Sanford, Florida. I think these guys had a great time. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And as always, if you want to see more videos about our crazy adventures with the without the puppies, just go ahead and subscribe. And leave a comment down below if you have any questions or you have any suggestions on dog parks that we should visit anywhere in Florida. Thanks again for watching and remember to eat well and travel often.